That's now that. let's go on to <laughs> an absolutely amazing set of tech picks. Okay. Let's take a look. This is uh, was sent to us from Stuart of High Point, North Carolina, and these picks, I call them a video file's dream. Now, he calls this a PS3 setup, and we'll get to that <laughs> in just a second, because you'll see one PS3 in a set of components, but what he says is, by the way, this is what $6 million will get you. Now, now this is a reference home theater designed yes. by a particular company that builds, if you want to own something like this, you actually can, yes. Kipnis. Kipnis Studios, this is their beta setup. They have an alpha, beta, and gamma setup. This is the <laughs> mid-level range if you would like to uh, start, say, not at the high end perhaps, but in the mid-range setup. And uh, go ahead and uh, run down this. This is just incredible. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's, uh, let me go through a partial, <laughs> a partial list of what, what components are here. Sony X, XRX S110 professional video projector, a Stuart 18 by 10 foot snow mat 1.0 gain laboratory grade motion picture screen. Nice. A Sony BDP S1 Blu ray player, PlayStation 3, Toshiba HD XA1 HD DVD player. The very first one. Uh, let's go down. Uh, a Theta digital generation 8 32 bit 8X <laughs> oversampling dual processors in their decoding. Uh, Macintosh MC2102 amplifiers, no. 30 of them. Yeah, there's 30. 30 and amps, 16 subwoofers. You know, 16 is actually the ideal number of subwoofers. Oh, there's the projector right there. The one at the top, actually. There's actually two projectors stacked yeah. right there. That top projector is what they call a 4K projector. It has close to nine. Every frame it shoots up on the screen is close to nine megapixel. It's uh, it's theater grade. It's and expensive. And if you, if you look really closely, <laughs> just good. above the speaker there, you can look straight in. There's your PS3. I hope that's a sub. One of the one of the 16 subs. Uh, let's see. Yeah, they have 16 subwoofers, two, um, Snell, Snell THX Music and Cinema Reference Towers, eight of them. Yep. I just, uh, it's Ten amazing. tweeters. They're claiming they can do an audio response on this system that goes below subsonic, like one or two hertz probably on up they claim all the way to over a hundred thousand hertz so that granted the human hearing system can't perceive all of that but you feel a lot of that oh, yeah. energy uh, low frequency responses even high frequencies will start to make your make your skin crawl really but that's surround sound uh, that, that, you think? that effectively <laughs> qualifies you know I'm not a I'm not a huge fan of tube amp stuff but the Macintosh designs every time you walk by their equipment you yeah. can't stop and not just appreciate yeah the glass and the tech and the beauty of it all. So we we'll, we will also have the uh, the links to to the Kipnis website up yeah. on the up in the show notes. I mean, this is just outrageous, amazing, man. outrageous, amazing. I want one. Uh, I need a room first to build out something <laughs> yeah. like that. Do you have anything large enough to take that? Uh, no, that ain't gonna fit in my apartment. I have to, <laughs> I have to lease some lease some land somewhere and get busy. <laughs> there we go. And also, please, if you have tech picks to show us and share, do send them to us. You can tag those. Uh, send those to dl.tv at zipdavis.com with the subject line that says, please, write in their tech picks so we know what it is and we can sort our email a little bit easier. And that's very, very cool. Yes. Up next, we're going to take a look at a new desktop, our very own Joel Santo Domingo. He's our desktop analyst for PC Mag. He's going to look at a new green-inspired desktop PC. Let's take a look at that. <laughs> 